Hey YouTube, Sweet Knives here. Thanks for checking out the channel. We got lots of awesome stuff. If you're new to the channel, hit that subscribe button. Um, you're gonna find that we got the sweetest stuff ever. This one here was sent in from one of our awesome um, viewers in California. You know who you are, buddy. Thanks a lot. What we're gonna do is we're gonna review this and we're gonna sharpen it. So this is kind of part one, but um, this is a legend of the past. This is an old style legendary knife from Benchmade. We're going to bust right into it. I'll show you the sticker so you can see it. it's model 2500 mini reflex made in the USA. These were one of the most popular sought after knives in the very early 2000s. And I'll show you why. Um, as you can see, just an awesome knife it's basically a military um, type knife that fell into their military class got an awesome uh, stainless clip with the old style small bench made usa logo i wish they i wish they still made clips like that for some reason i just like seeing the lettering in there i like seeing the usa i just think that's really cool uh, this is the knife. They made a lot of them in this pattern. So you got the Strikers, you got um, the Presidios, you got all kinds of them in this type of aluminum. Uh, just really awesome stuff. That's a look at the logo. I'll try to zoom in on that. Um, see if I can get in there. Well, <laughs> maybe I can't. Okay, there we go. Um, check that out. Bali Song. Uh, as long as we got that zoomed in, I'll show you a little bit of the the edge markings, the mechanism, and uh, just the design of it. Like I said, this is one of the first early ones that they had. This is the backside Benchmade USA. Uh, really nice, thin profile blade, as you can see. Zoom out a little bit. For all you guys, uh, this is one that's kind of a, a lighter, smaller uh, one that they have. And it that's, I think, the thing that people really liked about it. It wasn't, it was really lightweight. It could fit in your pocket really easily. You didn't even know it was there. And it still um, deployed extremely well. And it fit just perfectly in the hand. And it's just a, a nice slicer with this basically full flat grind. And it has a, a really nice deployment. These are really cool. If you guys can get one of these, pick it up. I think these originally went for right around 200 bucks um, when they first came out, maybe even 250 And they're long discontinued. Um, just you can't, you can't find them anywhere. So uh, it's a spring, uh, basically a spring auto type knife. So when you push this button, that's it, deploys. So again, really nice military grade knife that Benchmade put out in the early 2000s. Love this knife. Um, we're gonna test the sharpness um, and basically we're gonna sharpen it up. So that's the next steps. Thanks for, uh, thanks for staying with us. Have a great day. All right guys, thanks for uh, joining part two. We are sharpening up this um, awesome Benchmade here, Legend of the Past. Let's uh, let's keep it going. So I got 200, we're matching the angle. I got black magic marker on there. You'll see this come off as I start sharpening. See, it's coming off. Just grind away. We're not gonna put too much of a different angle on here. It's pretty much gonna be the same, same angle, which I believe was, I don't know, 23? Something like that. I thought it looked good the way it was, so we don't need to we don't need to modify it too much. Just make it look nice and sharpen it up. God, you can just see these stones take away the the material. It doesn't matter what kind of sharpener you got. If you got a uh, wicked edge or you got to work sharp what you got to do is you got to take your time on these steps right here and make sure you get you get it you know you gotta get it right otherwise if you don't get it right then it's not gonna be right
looks pretty good to me. looks really good hopefully that's showing up on there I don't know how well I'm gonna just see I don't know sometimes it it's almost like there's too much light Let's rock and roll. Make sure these are tight. They are. So good, I love it. Do a little bit more there. Go to six, go to 600.
God, that looks good. All right, moving on, 800. Let's rock and roll. Once you get things lined up, it doesn't really take a long time. Okay, we're moving on to a thousand. sharp okay done with a thousand now we're on to 1500 and then we're going to the 30 microns after that All right, now we're on to 30 microns. If you had other diamond stones, you could use them. Um, but if you have the 30 micron paper, this is a good, a good point. All right, done with those. Now let's move to 12 micron and nine. All right, 
Nein. Done with those, let's move on to the next ones. I got three, this is actually three, and one. Okay, on to one. Be careful if you do that. You could cut yourself. I mean, it's so sharp. Now we'll do the last one. What do we got here? 0.3 micron, like 40, 50,000 grit. <laughs> yeah. Damn. Damn, 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 that's sharp. All right, guys, hang on. I'm going to readjust and we'll show you the up close pictures of it. Thanks. All right, guys, here it is the finished product. Look at that. Perfectly mirrored edge all the way up. 100 times sharper than it was. This bad boy cuts hair so easy now. the way to go thanks for uh, checking this one out guys this is a sweet sweet mini reflex uh, knife legend of the past um, sharpened up now it's the way it should be all right if you like this hit that like button subscribe and if you need lapping films email me sweet knives 2020 at gmail.com i got them for all the systems uh, thanks a lot have a great day guys Talk to you later. Bye.